Thank you for coming to Productive Corporation's Two Minute Tech. Today we're going to look at deploying and configuring Kaspersky's full disk encryption. Today we're going to talk about Kaspersky's full disk encryption, how we enable it, and how we set it up. So let's get started. We're going to click on one of our managed computer groups. We're going to go to the Policies tab. And then I'm going to right click on the Endpoint Protection module and select Properties. And that's going to bring me to my encryption sections where I have configuration control over this encryption. So we're going to start out with the encryption of hard drives. We're going to click on it, and that's going to bring up our, our menu. And basically, it doesn't have an enable disable. What it does have, though, is it has a default encryption rule. And this is really where you turn encryption on or off for that group of computers. So the default is to leave unchanged. So if, there's in, if there are computers in that group that don't have encrypted disks, they will not get encrypted. If you want to encrypt them, you have to select encrypt all hard drives. And that gives you your disclaimer. And away you go. So now, all drives in those computers will now get encrypted when I'm through here. However, you might have drives that you don't want encrypted. And if so, you can add them down here. And those will not be encrypted. The other thing that's important in this window is to select which user accounts have access to the computer once it's encrypted, because they will have to enter their decryption passwords which, if you use single sign-on, would be their domain accounts. So there I would click on this hyperlink called Users. And I want to make sure that all accounts on the computer is checked, which should be by default, and all domain accounts on the computer should be checked if you're in a domain environment. This is not default, so you'll have to check that. The rest of the defaults in there work just fine. Once I do all that, I'm pretty much ready to roll this out. So I'm going to hit OK. And what's going to happen is the policy is going to get rolled out to the computers in that group. The computers are going to require a reboot. And whether I manually have my users reboot or I go out there and reboot them, uh, or I could force a reboot based on a schedule, uh, they need to be rebooted. And upon boot up, they will have to log in with the decryption password they want to use going forward. That's a very important step. Once they do that, the computer will boot up, and disk encryption will start, and it could run for several hours, depending on how big the disks are and how much data is on them. And uh, at some point, you'll be notified in your log that disk encryption has been deployed, and it's fully operational. And that's full disk encryption by Kaspersky. Thank you for coming to Productive Corporation's Two Minute Tech. If you need additional product information, configuration, or implementation services, please contact us at help at productivecorp.com, 800 726 4099. We are here to help.